walking along Fifth Avenue in the Upper East Side bring a lot of personal recollections and memory. When I first arrived in New York in 66, beautiful location, provided me with an extraordinary experience. Here I found myself in a place uh, neighboring the Guggenheim Museum, the Cooper Union, the Jewish Museum, the National Academy, and so and down so many art centers, and of course the spectacular uh, Metropolitan Museum. And, and then I set out to acquaint myself with this, with its uh, vast and fantastic collection of some of the greatest uh, art produced by every known civilization, from the ancient to the modern, Chinese, Egyptian, Greek, Roman, the Renaissance of Italy, Europe, through the Romantics, the Realist, Impressionist, Expressionist, Surrealist, and so on. So I immersed myself in the works over the course of time. I remember in uh, later after I moved, around 69. A big event here uh, at the Metropolitan in the show of American Contemporary Art where I saw uh, a group of famous artists on the New York art scenes. And, uh, the artist was like who's who, who's who in the art world, from uh, Rauschenberg, Warhol, John, so, so, so many, uh, so many famous uh, artists. At that time, in '69, I was uh, living and working uh, a few blocks down 76th Street, between the museum and and my studio in New York is the Duke uh, Mansion, uh, which is. Uh, the NYU Institute of Fine Arts, where I spent uh, quite a time using this their fabulous library, which has a great collection of artworks.